Oh, good morning. Yes, I did say I was going to do a video on the lodge that we've been staying at for, well, we've actually stayed here for four nights. So, uh, yeah, good morning. Welcome back to another vlog here on Coast of Crazy. This is going to be a very quick one take video. I'm going to pretty much do the whole review, the whole tour in one take the best we can because we need to go it's uh well i've got i've got four minutes to try and do this review i did bring my drone with me to go and get some uh some nice shots and stuff but there's a lot of you can hear them there's a lot of birds crows ducks everything around here so i didn't i didn't really want to take it up plus i can't be bothered anyway so yes um basically we wanted to stay in um a lodge for a while with a hot tub and um obviously last week it was um school holidays so we didn't go then and we did look at like maybe cornwall i really wanted to go down to cornwall maybe do flambards again i really want to go down to land's end so there's a few places we want to think about and then the other place was um yorkshire which i really like i love yorkshire york is my favorite city in the uk although we didn't do it on this trip you, you've seen what we've done pretty much i think we did a couple of things off camera like we went to uh, scarborough last night which was a complete waste of time because it was we got there at seven o'clock and everything was closed like there was about four arcades open a couple of ice cream shops and that was it there was no pubs no restaurants nothing complete waste of time anyway right enough enough of that this is what i'm plugging this is where we are if you want to stay here please don't hesitate to um to do it to book it um the whole price i paid for four nights was 386 pounds for three nights we technically got uh, sorry four nights we technically got um like five days because we got here monday sort of afternoon and we're here friday morning so it was technically five days four nights and what we stayed at or where we're at is um i can't show you the thing the actual paper i've just got to read it off it because this is like a barrier code and the key box code and everything's on the front of here so i can't really show you that um but yeah it's Ollathorpe golf and country park and um where we actually the actual one that we picked was the uh, peace lodge because so they're all different they're all different numbers and it's absolutely stunning here but it is a golf resort really because the golf um course is just over there there's this th th like this whole resort's pretty much brand new um yeah there's a restaurant here as well called uh simply jj's bar and restaurant it's absolutely stunning i don't think there was much here i can show you the map of where we are so the little circles where you come in and we're basically number six up here so it's a big resort a lot of it hasn't even been finished yet uh, there isn't anything else there's no like swim pills or spa or anything like that it's basically the golf course or what you say there and like a few uh, lakes so anyway we'll take you in so yeah basically when you turn up um you've got to go into reception they give you the key you do have to pay a 200 pound deposit which i mean we didn't break anything you'll see in a minute because that's why i've got recorded because if anyone says oh yeah, yeah it's a mess uh, 200 pound you're not getting it back tough i've got it on camera <laughs> so uh, yeah so you basically i'm obviously got not got to get a registration in if i can try it yeah the sideways so we've parked here you get like a little parking space here and this is where we are, um, Peace Lodge. Uh, I think they're all slightly different and we did it through booking.com as well. I'll put the thing down here, booking.com. Uh, and you can also go through Host Seasons, I think you can book it through. So there's a couple of things. And when you go on booking.com and put in a lodge with hot tub, it's pet friendly as well, obviously. Um, and it's got the hot tub, which I'll show you. It's not running. We did go in a couple of nights and we've never done a hot tub. Oh, I haven't anyway. It was so hot, like 40 degrees and there's like sweat dripping out of you even though you're sat in water. It's been absolutely stunning. And we, if I could afford one, we would buy one of these and then obviously just rent it out to people um, when we're not using it. And we'd, we'd come at Christmas and out of season because it's, really quiet <laughs> it's really nice so yeah let's uh let's go and have a walk around so yeah it's peace lodge we actually really like this style a lot of them are you know pretty different styles but we like like the gray wood effect uh would be nice to have the the bottom match the top but i think they're all the same uh like they've got a brown one with a like a 
sandy colored bottom and white ones with different color they're all different slightly different models but this is one of the newer ones so yeah you got a nice uh, tarmac drive here you got like a bit of a garden i'll show you around the back on the deck but yeah it's amazing it's so nice so when we got in here i would like to say it's pet friendly so you you can lock the gate Some really nice neighbours there across they actually live here so um yeah so well, this is the actual make of the the lodge atlas leisure homes and yes there's i told you about the birds there's like bird poop everywhere <laughs> it's all over the decking it's all over the, we didn't use the furniture and yeah so it's a 40 uh 40 meter by 20 meter size so it's, it's pretty big i think it's 40 meters no, it can't be 40 metres, can it? Is it 40 foot? Yeah, it must be 40 foot by 20 foot. Yeah, it can't be metres because there's no way that's 40 metres long. So, yeah, you walk in, you get the key. The I'll show you what happens. So, we've got here, we've got, like I said, there's a code. There's a hot tub. <laughs> so, we've got a code, which is at the back of here. And the key's in there. So, yeah, obviously can't get any closer to that because I don't think I changed the code. But the codes, they give you the code. Hot tub's really nice. Uh, you just lift this up and it's all sunken underneath. I'll show you that. Woo! Yeah, it's still hot. <laughs> yeah, it stinks of chlorine as well. Obviously, they've got to put chemicals and stuff in it. But it stinks. And you, when you get out, you've got to, you've got to go, have a, go and have another shower. But look at the bird muck and stuff on it. But yeah, you've got all this space out here. You can walk around. There's a pond over there. There's a lake. On the other side, obviously Lisa's just taking Tilly for a walk because we've, we've got to go. But like I said, they're all pretty different, pretty much. And you can do your own thing to it if you owned it. Uh, like they got rid of the, oh, she's back. They got rid of the hot tub and put all the nice plants. But yeah, you get the furniture here, which is covered in bird muck. Right, I have to do this pretty quick. Been going for seven minutes already. Yeah, so you walk in. So you get the nice little uh, drying room. Uh, there's like Christmas decorations in there. You've got a washing machine in there. Mop and bucket for mopping up. Just, yeah, random cup. I mean, the space here is unbelievable. Oh, there's the box with the lock safe. I think there's a, a spare one in there. Yeah, um, really nice it's stunning i mean the carpet's really nice but look at the space like this kitchen is amazing it's better than our kitchen at home it really is it's like a nice olive green color yeah it's it's really nice uh one niggle we do have well there's actually a couple um yeah the this sofa here is a, a sofa bed so it's not it's not really comfortable and you sort of sink into it but it's really nice it's yeah it's just old-fashioned sort of it doesn't really matter if it gets ruined because it's, you know obviously people are staying here i mean there's like you can see stains on it and yeah the, the, the sofa is not probably the nicest thing about this but it's lovely in here um yeah like the tv it's it it, it does for what it is it, it does it's not you know the best tv or the best sofas but it's absolutely stunning there's your uh, stuff for your, um, for your seating out there. Obviously, you can open the doors. And you can step outside. Both of them open up, French doors. So it's really nice. Yeah, I would have got some footage of us in the hot tub, but you don't want to see me with not much on. It'd, um, yeah, I'd probably get a copyright strike or something. <laughs> and then, obviously, I was got to do some nice drone shots, but the weather's been pretty naff the whole time we've been here i think we literally picked like the wrong place to stay um because i've seen a few people at thought park the other day and the weather was really nice we had a really nice table in fact we've got the same place mats at home because <laughs> lisa likes bees so yes we've got the same place mats i think they're from dunelm a lot of the stuff lisa's like oh yeah it's from dunelm that's from max and spencer's and yeah, so there's a lot of stuff in here that's obviously the people that own this put in here to make it homely. You get a bin with liners, there's a dishwasher, a uh, kettle, uh, you've got to bring your own tea and coffee and juice, um, stuff like that. There's a fridge freezer, 
Oh, there's the freezer, the fridge in there, it's all nice and clean. Nice big sink, the, the cupboards everywhere. You've got Alexa stereo here, so you can play music outside. You've got your cupboards, everything's all stacked up, so you don't really need to, need to bring a lot of stuff with you. We just brought coffee and tea, and got milk and bread and things like that. There's a, w a wine rack in there, wine cooler. The, the, the oven's really nice, it's a proper nice cook master. Uh, plates and stuff are all in here. There's games and things in here, so there's lots of stuff to do. You know, it's really nice, it's really comfortable, it's really warm. You put the heating on um, here, and it's just boiling hot within like minutes. So, lots of lighting in here as well. So if it's a bit a bit vague and a bit quick, but like I said, we've we've got to go. <laughs> it's the last day, it's the last minute, but you know what I'm like. Nice um, main bathroom, shower was all right, but it's all plastic. That's the thing with this is everything's all plastic, so like fixtures don't really fit well to the wall because it's it's plastic, um, like all this slime. <laughs> moves around and stuff but it's fine it does the job it's it's basically a caravan isn't it glorified caravan so yeah leave everything open to air show you the main bedroom in a minute you've got a spare room again really nice with another tv uh wardrobes there's lots of space everywhere so you could stay here for for weeks we didn't use this at all we just had our suitcases on the bed in here we don't know we haven't even used the towels so there's towels here but i would advise to bring your own maybe bring your own pillows as well because the pillows aren't great that we found and yeah the main bedroom so the only other niggle that we had the mattress is terrible it's one of the worst mattresses we've ever slept on it's 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 not great there's, there is a topper on it so yeah, just you might not even if you want to book this place, you might not even get this this lodge. But yeah, the mattress they need to replace that whole bed to be honest, and put a new mattress on it. But once you're in it and you're settled, it's quite comfortable. Yeah, maybe bring your own pillows and stuff. But other than that, it's fine. Nice curtains again, another TV, which we didn't use. You got a walk-in wardrobe that's got random stuff in it. Little Hoover iron ironing board. I think we could have probably used that top a bit there's more pillows and cushions nice uh, dressing table i think that even when we stay at some nice hotels lisa sometimes struggles to do her hair and makeup up in the you know in the, in the dressing tables and an ensuite bathroom which i think lisa you yeah i didn't use this bathroom so yeah, nice and so you can see it's nice and clean. We've tidied it up the best we can. It's got one of these fancy mirrors that lights up. I don't even know how you do it now. <laughs> how do you do it? Is it one? Oh, it's a fancy thing. Yeah, so we left the towels. So yeah, bring your own towels, bring your own bedding, your pillows and stuff like that. And you'll be fine again, look, with the fixtures, everything just, oh, the toilet roll wasn't good as well. So we brought our own toilet roll. But there you go. That's it, one take. How long has that taken? 14 minutes. There you go. <laughs> right, so, yeah, we're off now. I hope you've enjoyed this little tour around. It's absolutely stunning. It's absolutely good, you know. We've really enjoyed it. We really have, so we've got to obviously turn everything off now. Make sure everything's done. I've got to put the key back in the lockbox. And then we've got to go to reception and do what we need to do then we need to be out by at least 10 o'clock we might even get some breakfast in the restaurant there isn't any point showing you really anything else like i said i would have taken the drone up and flown around but yeah it's absolutely stunning and what a place to come and stay in a quiet out out of season town it was my birthday um on wednesday so it's now friday morning um yeah, we've loved it. We, we can't recommend it enough, to be honest. And like I said, it was only £386 for four nights, which is cheaper than staying in a hotel. It's really good, and we really enjoyed it, and we really want to buy one 
but obviously we can't afford one because <laughs> I think they start from about 80 odd, 86, 89,000 or something like that. So uh, yeah, I've got a lock up. Uh, I've got the keys here. Get me a new Helix bag. And there we go, off back home. Oh, everything's all packed up. Just uh, make sure everything's locked away. That's it, that's the end of our uh, holiday. I've had, a, I've had a lovely two weeks off. I think it's it's been amazing, but it's, you know what it's like when you have a holiday, you always want another holiday. So uh, yeah, I've had a great time in Yorkshire. We've done so much. We did Flamingo Land. There you go, it's all locked up. Flamingo Land, we did the Pickering. Uh, Pickering to Gofland uh, Railway yesterday. There's another, that you've probably seen the video. You've seen what we've done. And then obviously we went to, um, uh, Scarborough last night which I didn't show you um, yeah I love Yorkshire it's it's a really nice county the roads are really nice to drive on and it's yeah really nice here but there you go if you enjoyed this don't forget to comment like and subscribe just there on the side hit the notification bell for next time we'll upload another video and yeah if you've enjoyed this little preview of Peace Lodge here at uh, Ollathorpe Country, I think it's Prestige or something I think it's with. We are absolutely stunning. Right, give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.